how's the shelter help me to get off the streets at night? Well, we're at the thermal shelter tonight, and this is our last week. We have a couple nights left. We close on April 30th, and we just wanted to say thank you to the community of Warren County and to the county for letting us use this space that we're in. We've had so much support the last six months we've been open, and we've had 15 churches that have been helping us. We have so many community members that have come out and helped us. We've had every single night people have brought food to help feed and brought lunch and breakfast. We just had so much support and we're so, so thankful that we've been able to do six months this year. My name is Stephen Thompson, called me Grasshopper, and I want to tell you that grace was applied to the shelter, that they watched over me and kept me safe from hurt, harm, and danger. You know, whenever I came here, I was, I was fed properly and I was properly taken care of. And I even washed my clothes. <laughs> and, and, and you know what? And there's a lot of love in the, in the support here. You know, uh, if I cheapen the gift to say thank you, would, uh, to say thank you would cheapen the gift. You know, but uh, thank you, ma'am, from the heart. And uh, I know where I came from, and I know who my friends are. Peace and love, baby. I'm um, just say Michelle Melser and, and Mark Melser is wonderful people. And uh, we got to thank the, the staff too and all our uh, ones that come to the shelter to help us. Okay, here we are at the thermal shelter. We're at the uh, food line. What we'll do is actually the guests will come through one door over here. They'll get a tray. We'll serve them our dinner, how many uh, whatever they choose to have. Tonight we're having sloppy joes with salad and potatoes and a cupcake as you see for dessert. Uh, they can choose as much as they want. If we have leftovers, they're more than welcome to seconds. And it's going to be a great meal tonight. Thank you. I'm Pina Louise Coles. I'm from Berkeley Springs, West Virginia. And I would like to thank the community for having the thermal shelter here. And it's helped us a lot. And I greatly appreciate the time that I've had here. I love it. Hi, we're here at the shelter tonight. Um, our guests have just come in and the rules have been read. Um, I'm standing here by the snacks that have been donated um, from our community. And each night uh, we have um, somebody deliver food, whether it's a church that has volunteered for the week or whether it's an individual, they come to the shelter and they bring the food. Um, we have volunteers every night. My husband and I have been volunteering. This is our third year with the shelter. Um, so we've been doing this for the last six months and we're so excited. Um, that we get to help out once a week and we're kind of sad that it's stopping right now, but um, we'll look forward to seeing them in the fall. Yeah. Hey, welcome to the thermal shelter of Fort Royal. It's been a blessing and a privilege for my husband and I to be a part of this for the last three years. This year it's um, been um, different. We've been way more involved. Um, a lot of different nights we've been down here and um, tell you a little bit about what happens behind the scenes. We are in the coffee bar here. Um, the guests that we have have breakfast uh, given to them in the morning. It's a cart full of all kinds of things that they might want. We have fruit and hot carts and just some breakfast biscuits and a lot of different things and of course coffee is a staple. And the guests are also given a bag of lunch. Um, so they are well fed here and dry. I'm JP, I'm a volunteer here whenever I can. I come a few times a week or at least once a week when this place is open. Uh, I have some fun doing it, you know, just being out just, you know, being of service to some people, even just doing little things like getting a drink or a napkin or whatever they want from the back room, as it were. Um, it's something that's really, really needed in this community. I'm glad to be a small part of it. Well, thank you. Um, a lot of our friends and church friends for your donations of the food that we are able to offer the guests here. 
We've had 93 people come through the thermal shelter this year, which is a lot more than what we've had in the past years. And we have been open for six months, so that does increase our numbers. But even this week, the last week we're open, we've had two new people come to us. So um, the need is here in Warren County, and we are so thankful that everyone is supporting us. And we will be back again next year.